these pieces put on here. Uh, all I've got left is this strap, and they're weathered. Uh, I'm gonna go up here and dry fit it. If it works. If it fits good, then I'm gonna go ahead and paint it while it's before I even put it on. Oh, not a very easy spot. by the name Duty Duderson. Part of it's done. Should be enough paint in this can. That way it don't drip. You gotta make that face too. If you don't make that face, it's gonna drip. easier to paint when it's flat than it's on the wall. Ok, 
Keep on level, you always want to paint the tops and the bottoms because they rot from that part. They get water sitting on it. Man, this stuff sucks up the paint. It ain't gonna take long to dry. I don't like that crack. I'm gonna beat a cock in there, so I'm gonna get some paint in there. All right, guys, I won't pour you with all this. I'll come back when I'm done, when it's dry. All right, I got them both up there. I gotta go back up there, see how the top's not in the slot. It's hard to work from there. Cause I gotta reach around, I can't really see that. And then this ladder's not big enough. I can't put that ladder. Well, I could probably put that ladder there. Well, let me go up there, I'll get that fixed. Then I'll move on to something else. What are you two nosy things looking at? Huh? Don't really like to be on the ladder when we got thunder and lightning going. Oh well. All right, I got them pieces up there. Then I got hit with rain. <laughs> and it was thunder and lightning. But uh, I got those painted, got them up there. That's more, most likely going to be covered up once I get the deck, uh, the railings up and all that. I'll probably do something different with that. I got to get up there and zip off that Tyvek that's behind there. Uh, that was a very difficult spot. I had a hard time lining it up because I could only go up so high with that ladder. And I had to to put the board on I had to go up this ladder but then I'd have to reach around I couldn't really see where the lip was hitting and there's a little piece there that needs filled in that's gonna be no problem like I said I'm probably gonna do something else with that later uh, that's just to get them you know get that whole thing completed and there was no sense of putting it up there without painting it. it just makes it a little easier later so that was about all I was able to get done today I know the Sun was right there but man, it is like 68 degrees. That rain really cooled us down. I'm, I mean, these nights are just great now. They feel good. Yeah, what else I do? I ran some caulk. You know, I realize that doesn't look the best. It will when I'm done. Uh, I just wanted some caulk in there. Uh, some of these had bigger gaps. I'll tell you the problem I ran into, and you can see here on this foundation. See, you got a lip there, but then here you don't. Well, this foundation is not square at all. It's, I don't even, I don't know how they poured it. But that was in the earlier videos where I had a level on that. This thing is just wonky everywhere. So, what I got left to do now, I'm going to build a small eave for this. Uh, I'm going to get up in there. I'm going to paint that up in there. I'm not going to put metal, like I said. That'll never see water. And it'll be fine. Well, it will see water, but not that much. And then I got to work on this fence. I got to figure out how I'm going to do this because I got to get in here. I went around today, uh, places, put some more screws in. There's still a few spots I got to get this, you know, with this foundation. If you got a bad foundation like this one, man, it's hard to get everything square and perfect. It just kicked my butt. And then let me show you something else. I, I had these strips going all the way across here. And uh, so I, I cut those out. Man, that stuff just, I don't know if they're going to hold up to the Arkansas heat. They're just hard to get them straight. I don't know if I'd invest in this system again. It's just hard to get this stuff looking straight. But I mean, from here. But it does look better with those cut out. And I still got to put the other 2x6 up in here. That's got that gap. And that was the plan to put the other 2x6. Get it caulked in. So, I guess that's going to be about it. Now this uh, mattress here weighs about 700 pounds because of the rain. But that thing had mold on it, man. I'm glad I got it out of there. But it's out. I think I'm going to just cut it up and... That mattress is heavy. Box springs don't weigh nothing. That mattress is heavy. But you can see the damage it got when I had water come in from the storm. That was the bottom of the mattress. And uh, and it got rained on when it was in the fifth wheel. So I just, I never use it till I keep it. 
But anyway, guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, like, subscribe, give me an I'm like, I don't care. I was hoping to have more on this video today, but it didn't work out that way. Weather always wins here. Happy trails. Well, hello, Miss Telly Tellerson. Your supper awaits you. You're having duck in there today. Yeah. And you got plenty of water. Yeah. Can I come see your supper? Yeah. You got boogers in your eyes. You got boogers in your eyes. Boogers. Miss Tellerson. Well, come get your dinner. I had it already made. You don't show up on time for supper. We feed at 4.30, Telly. 4.30 p.m. Okay, I had to keep that fresh for you. Yeah. All right, Lily, you got attention. Are you in jail? What did you do this time? Huh? How much is your bail? I'm tired of bailing you out. 